guys and welcome back to my channel today we are playing some more beast one simulator and in today's video we're gonna be checking out the business update 1.5 so yeah so before we start anything we gotta do the puff shrooms because the puff shrooms are here and puff shrooms well they're awesome so let's go ahead and do these puff shrooms really quickly here we go. Hopefully we can get a rare. I need them for my quest, right? So Hopefully we can do this. Let's go. Almost done this level 6. And where's the level 7 going? Here it is. Here. Oh, level 8. Even better. Even better. Let's come around here. And yeah, it's really hard. No, it is real hard to do this. But it's okay. So I don't see any rares right now. But hopefully we can see them in a little bit. So let's just continue doing this level 8 puff shroom over here. Almost done. Almost done. 54 seconds. That's lots of time. And link token. There we go. And we're almost done now. Okay, level 8 is finished. I don't know why. And yes, we, we see guys, we, we, we got the rare. But I don't need it in the clover field. Doesn't that suck, guys? Uh, it, it really does. Oh, we also got a vicious bee here. <laughs> Isn't that cool? Yeah, so we're not going to have enough time to finish this puff shroom here because only 16 seconds left. So, you know, that's okay. Okay guys, so since the puff shroom puff shrooms are done now, let's get on with the update. So what's new in the update is we have the new quests from Dapper Bear. Right, there's Dapper Bear. And we also have the one from Spirit Bear. And we also have one from the Honeybee. And one from Onnit, the developer in the B zone. And there's also one from the Gummy Bear, but we won't be able to do it because it's for end game players. So, yeah. So let's go ahead and talk to Dapper Bear because he's a new guy. And yeah, I, want, I really want to talk to him. Oh, and this looks like his thing. The strange thing is looking a little rusty. Okay. So let's talk to him. Give, let's talk to him. So as you can, so as you can probably tell, I'm still setting this place up. You'd welcome me in, right? Couldn't turn a stranger away on a honey day. Well, that is if I had something to share. Something that'll warm you right up straight down to your bones. This is a samovar. But with the little TLC, we can use it to brew up some potent spice nectar. Perfect for the winter. Nectar is absolutely essential for collecting pollen fast and, of course, making honey. And the samovar is perfect supplemental source for nectar of all types. I can tell you're intrigued. I was too on my first trip to Tula. If you and your bees help me gather some pollen and nectar, I'll play host and heat it up for us. Dapper bears. Let's see his quest. Okay, easy, easy, easy. Uh, planters, everything from planters on. Okay, and the nectar, okay, so hopefully we can do it. Let's see if we can, he has just normal quest, right? Oh, here, here's the fish. Each planter type is likely to give you a special reward the first time you harvest it every once in a while. If you use glitter on a field, it will grow 25% faster. Yeah, we all know this. Okay. Okay, so that's the Dapper Bear quest. Looks, looks okay. I think it'll take some time to do, right? So, yeah. So what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to go get the Spirit Bear, the Honey Bee, and on its quest quickly off screen. And I'll just be right back. Okay, guys. So we're back. And... 
so yeah i just received all the quests and yeah so they look pretty hard the honeybees honey wreath well yeah that quest it looks really hard because we have to do well tech basically we have to do 100,000 conversion links honey conversion links so yeah that's gonna take some time the honey tokens will take some time and i think the other hard part is the honey gift tokens and the and the using 999 honey suckles because that that's just gonna take a really long time because we have to get honey suckles and they only work once your bakes get full and they're on a cool down for 30 seconds so yeah that's that's not really great guys so yeah so what i was thinking we could do now is uh we could hand in my bee bear quest right because i'm almost done the quest i defeated the level 5 snow bear just recently and i think we just can buy a present from the catalog because i think that's just the best option so three two one let's buy it there we go and let's go in and hand the quest to big old bee bear Frosty the snow bear is a very naughty soul. Ho ho ho, bet you showed him. And now I'll start to show you something. A star jelly and two ticket planters. Wow, that's awesome guys. Star jellies transform a bee into a random gifted bee which grants your entire hive a special boost. And ticket planters are a million times merrier than paper planters. They grant much more nectar, at least 10 tickets, and a bunch of other... Marvelous items. You have done a bee bear proud, but there's always room for more pride. When you're ready to keep up the festivities, talk to me again for more quests. Complete five more and I'll give you three super smoothies and a festive planter, which is supposed to be really good, guys. Complete ten more quests and we get a star treat, which is even more awesome. So yeah, we got gingerbread, take planters, that's, that's what I really want the most. So yeah, uh, let's... Hmm, let's get the next quest, right? High up in the sky, watching us all. He knows if been naughty or nice. Uh, oh, okay. I think this is Bubble Bee Man. He's both bee and man. Let's see. Yes, I'm speaking of Bubble Bee Man. He's the reason Bee Bear became Bee Bear. Bubble Bee Man is the spirit of Beesmith itself. He's everyone watching us right now. How did I meet Bubble Bee Man? Well, I met him by chasing puff shrooms. What are puff shrooms? Well, they're a nasty fungus that infects our planters. Sometimes you'll notice when your planter is full grown, it'll be covered in smoke. Smoke is actually puff shroom spores. And you have five minutes. Yep, we know how puff shrooms work, so... Yeah, you just gotta work together with other beekeepers and work together. Just like how I and Bubble Bee Man work to get the festive puff shroom and gain my magical powers. And the ticket planter always spawns one, and yeah, just pretty cool things, guys. Remember, you can use up to three different types of planters at a time in three different fields. That's really awesome. I actually didn't know that. So the quest we got was puff rooms for presents. Let's check it out. Yeah, so I think, yeah, this quest looks pretty easy. Five puff rooms, that, that's really easy. I, I think the gingerbread's going to take the longest time. So... What I was thinking we could do now to end off this video is we have two presents. So let's go give the two presents to two different NPCs. So I was thinking the first present we could give is to Dapper Bear because, you know, he's the new bear and I want to see his ornament and what he does. And so, yeah, let's go ahead and let's give this present to Dapper Bear, our first one. A gift for me, but we hardly know each other. That must mean whatever in this box is based off first impressions. Well, let's see how you've sized me up. Crumple, crumple. Ah, so you think I look smart, huh? It's a book, a brief history of the bee swarm simulator mountain. Guess you will be relieved that I do in fact dabble in books. Well, that's great, you dapper bear. And I often turn to history. Thank you. So we get some snowflakes, a ticket planter, which is always awesome, a warm scarf, and the pot puri ornament. That's the new ornament, guys. Filled with flowers and leaves I grew in my planters.
So yeah, let's see. Convert rate, some dandelion, some plus 5% nectar. I think that's pretty good. And yeah, let's see the ornament. Got some pretty good things. Oh, that looks really cool. I like that ornament. So yeah, we got the ticket planter, 25 snowflakes, warm scarf, and we got a 3 times spider field boost. So yeah, that's, that looks pretty cool, guys. So I'm, I'm thinking the next present we could give to is either brown bear or panda bear. I'm still thinking, should we do the brown bear since we're here? Actually, uh, okay, let's go over to the panda bear. I think he'll just give a little bit better rewards. And because he's an attack, attacking bear too, right? Hmm. Oh, a gift. That's so kind of you. I'll open it now. A bamboo pull-up bar. That'll help me work on my back muscles. Well, I can't take something without giving you something too. So we get the boxing ornament, just like last year. So yeah, we just get some convert rate, capacity in the bamboo field, and some t plus 5% B attack power. That's the ornament. Same as last year, just the boxing glove. So, yeah guys, uh, that was... That's kind of it for this video. I just wanted to, you know, go over the things about this new update and things, right? So, yeah. So, I think I'm going to be ending it now. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And stay tuned for more content as I'll be posting a lot this week. So, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please leave a like, subscribe, and don't forget to turn on your notification bell. And I'll see you guys all next time.